Hi Sherry. Right, I have had a pee. I have grabbed a snack. Go and beat up some bosses, shall we? Hi Cheryl. So we'll go on mine, because I always go on mine. I load the right one. How are you doing, Sherry? So, where was I? I think I was still in the middle of a chalice dungeon. I think. Yes, I was. We were on the big floor, right. So, there's our boss door. Gonna go find the switch for it now. Got a bag man. Got openable door. with ladder leading oh so we'll go with this one first see what we shall see scythe man oh treasure room and door i can open two doors i can open crazy ghost one where was this? Sage's wrist. More Charles Dungeon stuff. Right. Need to get rid of Crazy Ghost Woman because. They actually managed to attack, didn't they? Hurt? What have we got round here? Two fire bros. Great. Oh damn. There. Down there we have big guy. Right, so you're going to be further along. So we got lost this way. Treasure chest. Open. Right. There we go. Yes. So this is where the ghost woman was. What have we got down here? We'll go other side of upstairs first. We've got another bag man. Bolt paper. Always oh, useful. This is a treasure room but it's empty wait has this gone into the previous area it looks like it has it has it's gone back there right, so 
Back up this way. This is like the secret side tunnel area. So we're going to go back through here. Back this way. This was just the other side of the secret tunnel area, so I could get that chest. So what's down this way we got? Nothing. More nothing. More nothing. Got a ladder going up. Door. And then the exit to the boss. So we will do door first. Ah, so this is where the fire guys were. So there is a big dude in here somewhere. Is there? There's not. There's a summon. Prospector Olek. We got a chest. Anything good in the chest? More ritual blood. Nothing amazingly useful. So that's you up the ladder then. Bye Dave. Enjoy your luck. We got witch. Surprise, man. Or your hatchet, man. Give me first, Charlie. And then go for the witch. Any more for any more? Oh. Nice bit of bell ringing woman over there. Where is she at? Where is she at? This way. You're coming from in here, so she must be in here. Good boy. We got bullets. And the switch is down there. Nice. Sure there's nobody else in here. There. More gems, what we want. So, door to the boss is open. So we'll explore this bit because the there was a ghost woman in here. So this is where we came in. What's around this way? Your oh, there's literally nothing else here. It's just drop down to this bit. Now, are you the one with the hidden wall? Oh, item. Almost missed it. Sponge and blood cocktails. They can be useful sometimes, but they're a bit cheesy, so I... That was a trap. I tend not to use the punch and blood cocktails, because they're just... Like you throw them at the wall, the enemy hits that wall and attacks that area, and you basically get free attacks on them for god knows how long. Hey, another uh, snatcher or bagman, however you want to call them. Right. 
bus room is over here. What you can't tell me is there another side path? It isn't usually just before a boss, but it's always worth checking. Anybody? No, yes, no. Right, it was down here. What are we getting? It's the last boss of it, so it's usually something complicated. We have... Oh! Is this the blood guy? Yes, it is. Do not like this guy. He moves weird. Prepare to find out, Bart. Ah, I could do a decent bit of fighting to him. Craig kind of looks like a vampire with his clock and stuff. Although I have barely touched him so far and he's eating up my healing. to use less healing at the start. I just got hit way too often. So I don't think I've got enough time to get a charged off on him. But I will try at the end of his combo. It's always worth trying. So I can get one off, especially on his back. It's a free visceral. I could also try parrying, but I am not so good at parrying the fast guys like this. See? He's got a long combo as well. Why is it when I want you to do a longer kind of you just do one swing? There. Ah, it's a decent chunk. It's like a fifth. Maybe slightly more than a fifth? Rush him. Got ya. There you go, parries did work. I just had to time it better. And that's that chalice dungeon done. Yeah. 
<laughs> so, same as always. Fuck you, Gavin. Check for upgrades. Check blood gems. So I don't think I picked up anything better. No, I don't look like it. Ooh. You are very slightly better. And then, yeah, you are still the same. Um, I don't think I got any gems for the gun, did I? No. Right. So you're done. Time for level up. Oh, I must have, what is Very well, let me. Um, so we were getting you up to 30, weren't we? Farewell, good hunter. And now, as is tradition, spend the rest on blood vials. Right, so where were we going to go next? Um, bit to the church. Yeah, Grand Cathedral. To the church and down the right hand side. There's a couple of hunters down there and maybe a chance for some upgrades. But I can't do anything else down there yet, but it's worth going just to see if I can get the upgrades. So away we go. So we've already been to this cut out first. So we've already been that way, because that led us to the witches, so now we're gonna go this way. Which I know for a fact this way takes us over to some hunters. I'm not sure if I'll be able to take them down, but beyond them is a chance for upgrades. Uh, and I want upgrades. Right. There he is. Oh, that's a decent bit of damage. On this one, at least. Both missed. This guy also has a really cool weapon. Like, if you're doing an arcane build, get that weapon that he's got. Give bolt paper. Right, there is another hunter here. This is the tough guy. Like his gun staggers every time. I and he's got a lot of help. There is a way of cheesing him, like just staying behind this. I always forget to turn notifications off on PS5. I will turn them off in a sec.
got you last time, didn't I? Got him! Now is the chance for muchos upgrades. Here we have. It's usually a snatcher up here, isn't there? Yeah, there is. Ow! Come on, use a spell or something. It's much tougher than regular ones. From Woodstone. Here. Got this nerd. This nerd. Now if I'm quick. Is it there? Is it gone? It's gone. Bah. So there are some bugs down here. One's already despawned because it goes over there. I'm gonna wait for this guy to come back up. See if I can't parry him out. And there's two little bugs down there I might be able to get. Come on. I know you've seen me. Both the bugs are next to the door. Now I've got you. Alright, now we've got the two little bugs next to the door. Thrown shards. Uh, plenty of upgrades. With a lead elixir. And then this bit that we can't do yet. So the only bug I missed was the wrong right up here. So I go up here. Not gonna be there, but I can respawn it and come get it. Because it appears like here it runs down. Oh, yeah, there's something on the roof as well. Right, let's go get stuff. We'll get what's on the roof. It on. Is it on the far roof? Don't matter, I've slipped anyway. Ah! There. Keep it close. So there's nothing on this roof. No worries, Bart. I am not going to go on too long anyway. Pretty cold. Right. So now we go back to the lamp, respawn, get the little bug that was running down there. And that should be a bunch of upgrades for us. So 
we'll head back into the Big Bad Church. Just dreaming them back again and then get more upgrades so that's what we want right then uh, bu -bu -bu. so straight back to the key roll get more stuff granted it's only going to be a short run just leg it back down where those two hunters were and try and get the bug down there they do have a proper name but I can't remember what it is so I just call them bugs because they remind me of scuttling insects. Also, I've got a few. Ah, giving me frenzy. Do not want frenzy. So these hunters should be gone permanently now. If I remember right. <gasps> I can hear footsteps. Is there a bug over here? There is. Missed it. I want them bugs. I want them upgrades. Bum, 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 bum. Off a few. Thanks for the vials. So there is a bug down this way. I must have missed this bug every other time I've played. Did not know there was one at the bottom of the stairs, I just heard it scrabbling then. So there's its footsteps. We are. And then just another one down this way somewhere. There it is. Thank you. Any more for any more? Is there another one down this way? There is not. But now we will use this. Mm. We'll go and get some of them upgrades. And now I need to go and get myself caught as well. May as well do the prison next. So, Q, quite high. So you need chunks. You need two more twin bloodstone charts. Wake up. Give me a level. Very good. 
8. So we'll get 5 health for 30. And then we'll start pumping just strength, skill, vitality. Farewell, mate. Maybe get maybe <laughs> get the endurance up a bit more. Now to go and get ourselves caught uh, is the best place to do that. Right, um... Come on, load. Why are you taking so long? There. Hello. Sorry, dear. You're much too eager. I've only so much blood, okay? Oh yeah, we need to Where is it? Oh, Ariana there. Use this. Oh hello. Sorry, hello. So next time we come back, she'll give us more. Old lady is still not happy. You never get into this mess. <laughs> and then, Mister doesn't like anybody. I'll spare you one nugget of advice. Beware the blind man. There, the beggar sits at the bottom of the bloody food chain, and then he's here acting like he owns the place. He's not to be trusted. What's he want with all those people anyway? Weasel has a murky past, I'm telling you. Well, yeah, he does look a bit weird, but right, what's out here? Hey! Oh, hello there. Perfect timing. I must warn you not to go near the tomb below Erden Chapel in the Cathedral Ward. Henrik, an old hunter, has gone mad, and he's my mark. Right, we are going to do this. Don't go near the... T I have business there first. <laughs> so we're going to go and fight Henrik. Because that progresses her quest line. And we want to do that. Because she's cool. Yeah, Ali and the Crow is a bit of a badass. So down here. That's all this. Back here. Now if I go down here, Henrik should be... There he is. Is Eileen going to help? So I make sure not to hit Eileen. Uh, I did then. Best thing to do is just shoot him. He likes charge attacks. There we go. Correct. When Eileen. That wasn't necessary of you, but you have my thanks. You must have killed Gascoigne as well then. He was falling apart, I'm sure it had to be done. But try to keep your hands clean. A hunter should hunt beasts. Leave the hunting of hunters to me. <laughs> yeah. Try to keep your hand. Leave the hunting of hunters. So she thanks us for our help. And then tells us to bugger off and talk to it again. So now... 
we're going to go and get ourselves caught. So the bagmen that have been wandering around, if one actually manages to kill you, sends you off to jail. So we're going to do that. It's usually one just outside here. We go kill a priest. Oh, he's not there. There should be a bagman over here. Come on, just kill me. There we go. Horny jail. Here we are. We're in the bag. We're in the sack. He just dumps us in a jail cell. Ta-da! Right, one thing I need to check. I don't have the priest uniform yet. Right. However, this is how good a jail this is. Turn my lights on. Door just opens. Walk straight out. So first we go go up or down first. Go down. So we got thick cold blood. Oh yeah, it's creepy music here as well. Creepy chanting music. And there's a priestess down here. Or a nun. Oh, please leave me be. Don't take me. Please. Oh, please. Dear God. So I can't actually do anything to her because you've got to be dressed as a priest to be able to talk to her for some reason. So she'll just ignore me. So we'll be back for her when we find a priest uniform. Time for horny jail. Right now, this place is actually a ball lake most of the time. But first of all, bug. Get back here. More twin bloodstone shards. There's the one up this way as well. There is not. This asshole. Straight up does half of my health in a single jumping bunch thing. So, got a bit of distance. Now, this one on his own shouldn't be so bad. As long as I actually get in range of him. Lamp and creepy statue. So now we've got lamp, we can like run around a bit. Nightmarish rituals crave a newborn, find one and silence its harrowing cry. So that's basically just telling you to kill a baby. You heard it here first, killing babies is good. 
I'm sure Beth would agree if she was here. Now this bit is a trap. She runs across there. Well this bitch is waiting to ambush her from the side. And you got these dudes waiting on the floor to get you. So let's get you. Get you. Two bagmen waiting there. Can I get a backstab off on one of them? Make this bit much easier if I can. I thought I heard one of them say something. Right, so we're going to try sneak up on this one. And he immediately went angry. That's just not fair. Use the janky doorway to my advantage a bit. taken care of. Now further down this way I believe is... yeah you're the boss. We'll come for you next time. So now we're gonna go up and out. So I'll take the check the doors up at the lamp first. I can't remember whether these can be opened from here or not. Nope. And... Nope. So we're going to go outside to open them. And out here is even more fun stuff. Putting another sneaky witch. And those things always carry pebbles. Like it's implied that the pebbles are or eyes or something like that. And now we have an old friend as well. Okay. Come on, up this way. In the back stab. Or not. India ass. And Piggy always gives blood vials. Almost always. So we'll clear this bit down out here. Because I know there's like nothing else down in this place. Just a few dogs. And some big doors which will open later. So we'll grab this man that's knowledge. We'll grab this, which is a fancy armor set. And more cold blood. And now we'll go and clear out both sides of the church of the what's well, it church, the jail. We have Everyone else to take care of. Take care of the dogs first because they will just ruin my life and fight. fight the bag man at the same time. Right, you do something. Right, 
just down here. Any items? Any bugs for upgrades? No, yes. Maybe. Items. More twin bloodstones. They're all good. And your shortcut sure back in here. So now we go down the other side of the jet. Let's see what's over that way. Anybody up here? Don't want anybody up. Looking down and getting me. Item. Nah, nobody there. So now we go this way. Anything down here? Any bugs? Give me upgrades. We're strong bugs as well. Twin Bloodstone. That all levels. Pretty much max out our gun for now as well. And you're the shortcut back to the lamp. So there is another piggy. Yeah, I can hear him. There he is. Anybody in here? Are you all? No. And there's a lift that doesn't work. So now, we're going to take out this piggy. We may have to face him out. I am on. Down here. Biggie, 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 big. There you are. I'm over here. So I'll do your charge thing. Got you. All right up in there. Bolt paper that was behind him. And now we have dags. Lots and lots of dags. Come on. Come get me. Are you coming or what? Dog sorted. Oh yeah, yeah. Got one hiding down this sideways. Well. So we need two. Got two dogs and a bag man. Can I? There was a dog. A rock. Was a rock at one of the dogs. Without alerting the others. It's like I can. Mm. One doggo. And now we just have this guy to take care of. 
can I be sneaks? Sneaks? Yes. No, almost. Oh well. Donitrus. Twin blood stone shards. Even more. So that's everything outside. And now to go and fight that boss I mentioned earlier. But first. Upgrades and shit. A very pretty picture of the moon. No, one reborn is later. When I go and see our good friend Dark Beast Paul. Yeah, it's the right area, Greg. Just earlier in the game. So. Go and max out this gun. Fuck you, Gannon. Uh, put the Tenitrus in there so I don't accidentally upgrade it when I don't want to. Um, so we got. Let's take these off. So we'll put Beast on. Beast is useful. Rune Rune, acquire more blood echoes. Physical damage reduction, we'll take that. Uh, may as well take that one then. Now for a bit more health. Welcome. Very well. Good night. We're only a little bit away, so. Oops. Now is one of the times I would use these. Farewell. And now spend the rest on vials. So we got 58 vials stored that should last us a while. Now let's go and see our good friend. There you are, Hypogean Jail. Hypogean literally just means underground as well. Hypo means under, Gian means ground, underground jail. Bloodborne car. Soon. Soon. So now we just run past these nuts. Because they are unimportant and slow. Uh. The witches I will still kill though because they have like a little The way she sprinted across there they can literally do that to follow you. So, uh do I have any fire paper on me? Uh I got No, I'm not gonna use blood pellet for all. I do have a fire paper, good. Cause he's dark beast pal. Because he's a beast, he takes more damage from fire. But away we go. Um, I will turn these off while I remember. None of you saw that one. So the summon you can have for this is Antal the Defector. Right, fault. One buddy. Too close then. I can't remember where the best one is found in this guy. I think it's next to one of his legs. I just can't remember which leg. But we will be going for these heavy shots. We won. 
ideally stop it moving as much as we can. Because when he gets a bit agitated, he does that. He can get fully powered up when he gets aggressive. He does that as well, which hurts a lot. Come on. In the head. Come on. Please. Are you gonna stop and explode for us? Right in the face. Good. Here you go, Greg. Say so you beat Darby's pal. Fire paper and chain together your heavy attacks as much as you can. And then you can open up the most useless shortcuts in the game. Because you can go through this door. For the path back to Gurney. Right, literally, you go up here, and you turn right, and that's the path back to German over there. Most useless shortcut. But Dark Beast is dead, and we have the Spark Hunter badge, which means we now have access to Spark Paper. That's what I want. I want access to both of those papers as early as you can. And now you can just mix it up depending upon what kind of boss you're doing. So, take off my bar so I don't accidentally use it. Welcome. What is it? You? Very well. We literally did not pick up any upgrades, so. Um. Yeah, we'll get Enduros up to twenty at least. Farewell, good hunter. And then the most important rule. Ah, uh, we will activate the next chalice while I remember. So it was. What order we do these in? Chalice Dungeon Order. This is a specific way to do them. Lower Thumaru. So we've done. Yeah, Thumaru Central, then we do lower. So. That's that Chalice Dungeon ready for the next time. We've got central, it's regular, lower is there ready for next time. And we spend the rest of this on blood vials to stock back up. So we're up to 65 now. And pebbles for the hell of it. Now we're going to 99 pebbles. So that will be us done. Done Dark Beast. Um, I will just jump into this, so I know where to start next stream. We'll start the next stream with a labyrinth. Come on. Load in and let me light the little lantern. Here we go. So there we go. Lower Thumaru Labyrinth will be what we do next time. But that's me done. So, fancy ending stream. So yeah, I'm going to try and do Tuesday, Thursday again next week. Like my new rotor starts at work, but it is a better rotor. So, yeah, Tuesday I'm in the office, but I should get home in time. Thursday I'm at ho working from home. Yep. 
Yeah, so the way the new rotor falls most of the time, I will be finishing Tuesday or Thursday, like, early. There's only the odd week where I'm working late on either of those days. And when I am working late on one of those days, I'm finishing early the other one, so... Tuesday, Thursday, Thursday schedule shall stay. So thank you for watching, everybody. Thank you for uh, sticking around to watch Gamescom. That was great fun. It sounds but. So yeah, there's uh, a bunch of games on from uh, Summer Games that I'll be keeping my eye out for. So I'll see you all next time. So Dave on Saturday. Um, is there anybody on to raid? Does anybody have any suggestions? I am always open to suggestions for raids. Who be online? Um, you know what? Fuck it. I'm too tired. I'm just going to end. So yeah. Thank you for the sub, Greg. But thank you for watching everybody. Thank you for the people who are lurking. I'll uh, I'll see you on next time. I'm gonna go and have another boomer nap now. Bye everybody.